Alright, let's go for the Sjogren Inertial Factory. I'll probably pronounce that wrong, but that's what you get if you're not Swedish. Alright, let's go. I guess this might be the first time I'm taking a different shotgun than the Model 10 Hunter. On this map. We have taken but I think this this will do fine as well. Time for a new record. I'm not sure if it's gonna be a record though. I'm using the wrong shotgun for that. Oh boy. <laughs> uh, just capping the points. The new shotgun is beast. The new shotgun is a beast. <laughs> we have taken objective butter. All right, let's continue. I think I should be using instead of the cannon. I should be using the grenades. I think the dynamite is fine, but I need uh, extra grenades for long range because the cannon is too passive. You need to lie down on the ground in order to use it, so that's a little bit taking too much time. There's a guy behind me, actually. He died. He died. There are like five people here. Or four. It's almost the same. I don't need to clear the other side. Oh boy. I got to really a lot of damage. What? I couldn't fire it for some reason. Got, oh, he's on the cannon again. Don't shoot me. Please. Be, be a good boy. I want to actually go for one shots. Damn. The thing is, if you don't go for one shots, this weapon is actually not that good. Because it... it I think the, the pellets spread out so fast that you you just miss out on a lot of damage if you just would come up a little bit closer the thing is like they're still having charlie flag he didn't die amazing well there's gonna be a shotgun party here that i can tell you guys i'm dead uh, please save me. Yeah, behind me. Oh, I knew it. Oh, and he actually came from the bridge as well. That didn't work. Shot and king, ladies and gents. <laughs> But the Shotgun King would be the Model 10 Hunter, absolutely. Even though after the the nerf from two or three patches ago, this gun still rocks. Um, but I wanted to test out the new gun, of course. There's a guy like here, and there's a lot of people on the bridge. That's a really bad idea. Oh my god, there's so many people down there. We have lost objective Charlie. Wow, I almost killed myself though. I completely forgot about, this, about the first one though. Oh my god. Okay, I'm out of here. Go die. Dang, I cleared the bridge though. Alright, that's fine. All these guys actually crawled up to the middle of the bridge. Which made it harder for me to hit my dynamite. Oh, I actually shot at the last second. There's a guy actually made it all the way to, to the left here. The shotgun is really, really on long range though. I think there's still one guy that made it all the way to, to Bravo. Yeah, they did. I'm gonna go back here, even though this actually means I'm gonna get less kills because I'm falling back to, trying to defend the flak. Still wanna win this round instead of like Trying to have a guy that is back capping. Problem is, I'm, I'm a bit. Wait, really? 
This is a bad idea. I think it's still not destroyed. I think we did it. Okay. I'm really, like, every time when I play this map, I think there's like a 60 to 70 percent chance me dying in Bravo because somebody does that explosion in the back right there. And it happens a very, very lot of times so. though. Well, that didn't kill him. I hit a guy for 70 something and then for another 80. Oh, I got a triple shot. In. A triple. Okay, I want to play this smart. I don't want to just instantly die here. Okay, we have some backup. I'm fine with that. Oh, he's blocking my shots. No. Blocking my shots. I really need some ammo though. Badly. Like really badly. Guys, stop passing by people. Oh, I could really use some ammo. <laughs> wow, that guy actually hit a martini shot from the... From the run actually. That was a nice shot. Alright. Actually guys, we're playing on 2200 DPI. I actually lowered it by 100. I need to actually change my settings on that. Oh, Gotta save our teammates. Need to save your teammates! Wow, because of my shot that I hit, um, well, I actually se uh, secured two kills with the anti-tank grenade. I'm sending a bit of kills here. Jesus, this gun is amazing. Again? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm in a really bad spot here. Of course, the shotgun is good up close range, so I need to let them guys come to me. I thought there's nobody in there yet. Now they're actually inside. The problem is I don't have eyes right now. Too many people. Like, I should have actually moved a little bit faster when I had the uh, flare of my teammate up. But I didn't find like a good window to actually keep going because there was still like a guy with automatica running next to me and I don't know. I think I was a little bit too too scared from that guy. Also this teammate dies. Would have been a really good spawn. This map feels a bit darker than usual. I don't know if you guys see that as well. It feels a bit darker. 51-3. Can we break the record? Can we? Oh god, I missed three bullets. One more. Can't see him. He's up here. That's the one that I actually missed in the beginning. I only did 25 damage to the guy. Gonna be a suicide. 
This is the dead alley. There's a lot of people that actually come this way. But right now, it's actually not super clear. Okay, that worked. Shot there, Just wait a little bit. Damn. Should have waited a little bit longer with that. Well, that worked. I'm really lucky I still have the cannon. Oh my god. Oh, I thought it was clear. We had a teammate in the back. We actually had a teammate further away from these guys. I'm gonna fast respawn here, even though I could have actually waited for the revive, but I don't think it's gonna be working because they're running over the hill to try and defend it. Yeah, the best kill streak we ever had on this map was a 56 0. You know what? I'm gonna pet some points at the medic. Wow. I actually didn't know who to shoot right there. There's one more guy next to that guy. Wow. That was awful. Wait, somebody... I think somebody shot my dynamite while I threw it in the sky. I'm gonna try and get the last guys here. There should be one guy on the left here. On top of the hill. That was a nice kill assist. Okay, there's gonna be a lot of guys coming from Bravo. So I'm gonna try and hold out this side here. There's gonna be a lot of people. One guy passed already. He's on the bridge already. The thing is, like, I can't actually go there. So I'm gonna actually cover the other side. Can't kill him. Well, that works. I mean, shotgun is designed for these situations, boys. Oh, that didn't really work. Oh my god. Oh, it's still toward it outside. Nice. Oh, don't have any more. Inconvenient. Oh my god. What is he doing? I have five shots, not enough. Ah! Oh! I thought I would actually pick up his gun, but I was like, like a second too far, and I like a meter too far to actually go there. Oh, I could have maybe waited for the revive. I'm not sure. No, it's fine. It's fine. The bad thing right now for a record attempt is um, if we continue grabbing four flags, then this means that the enemy team is gonna have, uh, of course, less tickets to work with. That was a double. Oh my god. Oh my god! No! Ah, oh, the mini grenades. Might just still a guy here. Rampage, boys! 79-5. The problem right now is we're holding actually five flags. An enemy team is getting the behemoth right now. Um, which means that there's probably not going to be a record in here. Although we're still on track on getting over 100 kills. Because we're having 79 kills. Which means that we should be on 790 tickets. This is not the case. But because we have five flags, you should just check how fast the tickets are going right now. It means that every 10 tickets, I should actually get a kill. And like, we passed, like, just from running from the hill up to here, I should have got two kills. What so are you looking at, huh? It doesn't work. Like, it goes too, too slow at the moment. So I'm gonna try and get myself in a position where I'm not gonna die from the train. Which is just this case. But so, I can actually use these things to, well, that I have, um, to hit the tank. But honestly, 
hit is not really gonna do much. I'm just gonna suicide and then die. I think the fastest way to win right now would be to just um, like secure the four or five flags that we have. Um, that way it actually would go the fastest. That worked perfectly. Right, I'm gonna try and go underground here. That would be really good if I can get in there. Which is probably not gonna be possible. Wait, I get shot? How? He shot in between the tree and my teammate? <gasps> that was a suicide. That was pretty stupid. I should have run the other side. Should have run the other side. Um, well, the train always takes Charlie. That's the easiest flag to take. Of course, you just drive into it. It was a bit of a suicide what I did there. Um, I guess I'll go this way. So the guy. Wow, I actually got hit from there? That's a really bad idea. As long as I have five bullets, it's fine. Good. I think he healed me first. I'm in a really bad spot. For yep. <laughs> I should have hit that guy. I mean, I should have killed that guy. I hit the guy. I should have killed him. Alright. Well, the enemy took uh, a little bit of tickets back, which is good. I mean, flax. Which in turn actually generates extra tickets for them to fight with. But I think it's going to be still a GG. Well, that's a bad idea. Sometimes this thing just doesn't want to deploy in the exact position where you want to. And then that seemed like a good idea to do anyway. The thing is, like, we're getting stopped on the left side from a sniper or something. That's all. It's next to the tree on the left side. I could potentially get the guy. Wait, I didn't even hit the guy? Oh, there it is. Okay, we're flanking. Well, I have no idea where I'm getting shot at from the left side. It's only 133 tickets, uh, 123 tickets we were working with, so... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just try and get as much kills as possible here. I know there was one guy on top of the bunker, which is kind of a weird position. Stand on in my opinion. I think I saw a guy. I'm actually not a big fan of this bunker, honestly. Wait, he was still inside that bunker? Yeah, I'm a bit confused right now. No, I should be capping the flag. But I'm not. Alright, we have the 102. That's fine. Oh god. Oh my god, I was- I tried to cancel the reload. And by this, I, uh, I don't know, I actually shot against the wall for some reason. Might get a revive. Question is, is that a good revive? Well, they're still alive. So I guess that's a good one. There's so many people here.
Oh, I got it right the wrong way. I thought my team wouldn't be going this faster. Nope. Over. Last shot. I should have probably not run in there. <laughs> Although it was the last ticket. Still like an extra death though. Alright, well played boys. That was a good round. I think we ended 107. 7. Or it's gonna be displayed as 107. 8. Possibly. We'll see. Good round. I should have used the boost. That would have been a little bit better. But Nonetheless. Pretty solid gun. Even flag is defended. Which means that I didn't only go for kills. But I still defended flags as well. Where should we end? 107.7. That's a really cool score as well. Alright. Good round.